A woman just trying to make ends meet in the midst of a pandemic needs your help getting her business back. A surveillance camera caught thieves driving off with her equipment, and she's not the only victim. Thefts are up in South City. Security cameras in this Tower Grove South neighborhood catch a black Jeep driving down an alleyway near Arsenal and Gustine Avenue around 4.15 Monday morning. My husband wakes me up, see, honey, I want to tell you some bad, bad news. Lin Chang says what you can't see are the thieves and the things they took. He said the trailer was being taken. The missing items are key pieces of equipment for Chang's new business. One day I was to look at a quick list and I saw there's a power wash and the truck and the waste trailer. It was like $8,500. I said, well, you know what? I can use that. Cleaning isn't Chang's trade of choice. Pre pandemic, she worked as a chef. She spent money she'd been saving to start the small business, hoping it would help her get by. I've been four since April. Uh, I saw we're going to going back anytime soon. Chang is one of several people burglarized in South City recently. In fact, News 4 found burglaries are up 34% in Tower Grove South, where she lives from year to year. That's yep. kind of scary. Like somebody was attacking to me and I didn't even will. Overall in the city, most burglaries are happening at night. Homes are up 14% and businesses up 62%. Chang says she hadn't even had the chance to use the equipment before it was stolen. While the truck remains, she's back to square one. Before I even start the business outreach, being shot down. <laughs> a lot of crimes are being tied to the pandemic. People searching for items in order to make a quick buck. The best advice we have for you tonight, lock it or lose it. That means lock up your home, lock up your cars, and lock up your garages.